<laughs> you know, I'm the oldest guy on the panel. I mean, Ernie Perron, George C. Scott, Martin <laughs> Scorsese, John Forsythe over here. And you're the best. But it's such a delight to be here. Oh, Peter. We're thrilled to have you. I thought I was going to a record pop. <laughs> Hello, folks. How are you? You picketed Dick Clark, you sold the sweater that Don Rickles gave you, you tried to play tennis with Charlton Heston, didn't work. You had Cardinal Kroll hitting golf balls into your pool, your mother cooked for Sinatra, and you kept watch at the Bruno viewing. But it was sitting across from Madonna that finally caused you to say, I better write this down. <laughs> Well, you know, I gotta say, I've really been blessed because I basically uh, am a street kid. And as the book says, uh, I grew up being half Italian, half Jewish. My mother married a Jewish racketeer. Uh, she met him at the Broadway theater at Broadway Snyder. And he was running away from the cops. He was a number writer. And my mother was one of the big family, the Capuanas in South Philadelphia. And she's sitting in a chair, and there's an empty chair here. And the cops are looking for this single guy. He runs, he sits, puts his arm around her, and she smacks him. The cops run away, and next thing they do, six weeks later, they run away and get married. And back in those days, you never married out of your religion. Because they would say, Masta Cristo, okay? So she was disowned, and my father was the black sheep of the family because he was a racketeer. And they got a little house uh, around 6th Street because that was the Jewish neighborhood. And what happened, he went away for a period of time. My mother became pregnant with my sister Roberta and she was born and uh, he got out. And they got together again and she still was not uh, accepted by the family, okay? But what happened, she became pregnant with me and I was born in 1940. He went away again, and that's when the Capuanas took her back. And she had to get a job as a riveter, the Navy Yard. So they would send my sister Roberta and I off to St. Monica's Day Nursery. And I grew up in a very amazing atmosphere family-wise. I really didn't know the Jewish side, because I was raised by nuns, and I knew all of the Italians. And I, I remember, though, that we were not accepted. Really, because my grandfather, I mean, really was my protector. You know, if I spoke out of turn, you get a crack. 